We, the, the people, people of the United States, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility, provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare, and secure the blessings of liberty to ourselves and our posterity. Do ordain and establish this constitution for the United States of America. Hello, I'm Alan Scholl for the Freedom Project, sponsored by American Opinion Foundation. In this episode of our Principles of the Constitution series, we're going to focus on the preamble of the Constitution. For many, preamble sounds like a word out of their league, but it really just means an introduction. So in other words, the preamble is the introduction to the U.S. Constitution, a document created by our founding fathers in 1788. It begins with, we the people of the United States. Immediately, the founders wanted to show it was the people who were establishing the government. The Constitution was created by the people for the people from their rights and responsibility to establish just and sound government in order to form a more perfect union. The Founding Fathers understood a perfect nation wasn't possible, but they felt a limited republic was the closest form of a perfect government for the imperfect people. Establish justice. The intent behind this line was to protect Americans from the many faults of unfair governments the Founders had come from. The Constitution was written to protect Americans from an all-powerful government ensure domestic tranquility. This means the Constitution is designed to help keep America a peaceful nation, bent on allowing Americans to make their own living and provide for themselves in a safe environment, provide for the common defense. This is rather obvious. The intent was to keep America protected as a nation against foreign powers and threats of all types to join the states together as a united front promote the general welfare, and secure blessings of liberty to ourselves and our posterity. The Founding Fathers wanted the Constitution to be a solid document that would protect them and their grandchildren from tyrannical government. Posterity simply means all future generations. And finally, the preamble states, do ordain and establish this Constitution for the United States of America. By this, they wanted all Americans to know and recognize the highest law in America is the Constitution, and no one has the right to violate it or any of its citizens. Despite the fact that the words in the Constitution are a bit different than the words we use today, it is still every bit as important and relevant as it was back then.